Hello everyone, it's Rich, and welcome to another game made by Chiller's Art. These games are amazing. They're not huge, they're not triple A games, but they're they're small and short and cheap, but they have excellent story. They're really well made. It's a horror game called The Radio Station. From a brief look at it on the Steam store, we work in a radio station and something's gonna go wrong. I honestly love these games. Every single one I've played has been so good. So that's why I'm checking this one out. Okay, to sum up, there's a, there's a little bit of a long talky talky intro of a guy narrating, but in obviously not our language. Well, in not English, and I was trying to read, but it was complicated. Uh, somebody talked to a dude the other day about his job at the radio station, and he was just saying, it just got on track, but then he died. The police don't know what he died of, and this guy finds that really strange, and the police have given up on the investigation and called it suicide. But then at the end, he was like, I'm going to find out who killed my brother or what my brother died of. There was no mention of him being his brother in the beginning, and that's why it was confusing why he was so confused. Uh, so I guess let's figure it out. Letter from the radio owner. The key to the radio station in the mountains is in the mailbox at home. You may take it if you need it. Hashimoto, hang on. Mazazaki is the guy that died. And I think he is th this guy's brother. And this is a letter from the owner. So the key to the radio station in the mountain is in the mailbox at home. Now, if he says it's in the mailbox at home, that would imply, because he's writing a letter to this guy, who we are, that they live together, and this person would be his brother. I'm confused. Uh, that's the car key. Do we have a flashlight? And I turned the VHS filter off just simply because it... Oh my god, is that our flashlight? It's huge! I turned the... Wow. I turned the VHS filter off because it does actually make it harder to see. I mean, it's cool if you're just playing at home, but it's a... Uh... Oh, hang on. This apartment style is very similar to the one from uh, the convenient... Not convenience, or that shift thing. Closing shift. By the way, if you haven't seen me play any of these games before, I should go check it out. There's a bunch of them that I've played. I'll make a playlist and put it in the corner. Oh, this just opens straight outside. We don't even have to load. Uh, we all, everybody lives in apartment complexes here, don't they? Get on, car. Wait. Oh, do I have to actually select my key? There we go. Do I get to drive it? Oh my gosh, look at this weird little map. Um, how do I know where I am? Is that gear stick blocking? I do get to drive. This is going to be hard. Holy crap. Oh my god. That's really loud for me. Yeah, I just gotta keep driving. Oh, so I'm going past the radio station to go get the key from this guy's house. I need to go straight and then take a right. Okay. Are we gonna see anything strange on the way? Hey, I think that's the that's the radio station there. We're gonna be going there soon. I'm almost here. This is the owner's house. Enter. Can I have my flashlight? Okay, I've just turned the brightness way up. What's that? That's weird. Is this door? There's a blasted mailbox. There we go. That's better. It's actually working. Uh, oh, there is. Key. Saving. Okay. What is this place? Can I get out? Can I just get out? Oh, this place looks interesting. It's a trash area. Ooh, I can.
Wait, what is that? Why are the puddles red? Rats seem hungry. There's like a body or a head in that bag, isn't there? Can't do anything with it. I'm guessing I actually come here later. Padlock. What's in there? It looks like a... Like a radio. Okay, I'm not meant to be here yet. Enter. Why is there so many car parking spaces? What does that say? Chief Coffee. 10 yen. Ooh. I'll save that. No, I want the key. Yeah, I'm gonna save it. Look at this stuff. This looks nice. See inside. Should I patrol the area before I go in? Computers. A tape recorder. A flashing uh, uh, lamp. What's that? Is that a tape? That's a tape. Put on the tape recorder. Oh my god! はい、鬼川正樹です。この when she was a preschooler, it wasn't too extreme. She couldn't see ghosts clearly, but she saw foggy figures and also felt certain places were cool. Oh, damn it, let me read. But when she came, an elementary school student, oh no, I okay with the story journal. It said there are six more of these tapes. I have to find them all. She was telling, uh, he was telling a story about a girl that could see ghosts like in Sixth Sense. What is that? What is that thing? Can I crouch? Vending machine ticket. Ooh. I don't, I don't, I don't want it. Right now, I'm not hungry. Uh, that's like a sound desk, a milk computer. What do they need two photocopiers? Three photocopiers. Just fi filling the spaces now. Uh. Nothing in the trash can. Uh, vending machine ticket? What do I go? What do I put it? Hey, there's another little building. There's a plant in the floor. Is there a tape in here? Really? There's no tape? I'm really shocked. That's where I would put one. Uh, it's over here. This is a radio tap. What? Oh, here you go. Bicycle lock. So I need a key, too. There's got to be one in this building. Because there's a puddle. Which doesn't sound important. But where the other tape was? There was one. Oh, wait. There's something odd about this monitor. They look the same. Break it. Oh my Jesus Christ. Who was that?
Oh, it's gotta be this guy's brother. Although, whoever the dead person is. Was that the tape, or was that someone in here? Oh, it was, it was this. Okay, I'm gonna read it and give you, give you a rundown. Okay, so basically, uh, someone wrote in about their cousin, who was very depressed and anxious and was very irritated. And she didn't like school. She felt it was the lowest of the low of her life. But she had this really nice best friend who would come around to her house and make her feel better and talk to her about her anxieties. One day, she didn't turn up and she was worried. She tried to tell herself she was too busy with her after school club. Then she heard an ambulance in the distance and then she got a call. Her friend had been in a car accident and died. Um, so she decided to try and commit suicide, but she saw her friend's face in front of her. She tried and called out her name, and she was a ghost. Um, and she convinced her not to. The, the guy telling the story actually said she stopped suicide. But I think it's meant to say she did, you know, she stopped, she stopped the suicide as in she decided not to commit suicide rather than stopping all suicides. I don't think that's possible. Uh, it's kind of a sad slash nice story. So, is there going to be another tape? Where's my car? Um, yeah, we're going to leave. There are multiple areas on this map. Oh my god, oh, there's a vending machine on it. Okay, so we obviously have to go to the vending machine. It's vending machine to you. Jesus. Honestly, the reverse is so loud and aggressive. Enter. Public phone, okay. Oh, maybe that's what my yen is for. Though. Hey, look at all these vending machines. This is pretty cool. Uh, wait, are these... These are tapes. Are they not? Yeah, they're tapes. Um, what? I need a code? Oh. A view V flashlight. Oh, that's neat. So it's two, one, four, three, maybe? One, three, two, four. What way is it? Who is this candy? I want this. It's my vending machine ticket for the only one. Oh, actually, there's a. Can I interact with any of these? Use the food ticket. Okay, what do I do with this? Some kind of strawberry yogurty thing. Wait, unless the first number is one, two, three, four. The second number is two. And the third number is seven. And the fourth number is six. No way. Okay. That's actually pretty simple. What's that candy called that I got? I gotta play this tape now. Wait, where's the other location? It's another building. Oh my god! I was not expecting that. Poor thing. Just run over and make sure it's dead. Um, let's go up here. Enter. Why does everywhere look condemned? Creepy. Wait, no. Flashlight. There you go. Is this the old radio station or something? I wonder if this. Oh, yeah, look. There's a. There we go.
I just hit something creepy. Oh, God. Hello? Voice recorder. Uh, give me back my blasted light. So it wasn't a tape, it was a... A voice recorder. Hey, there's another car. They've done something to my car, haven't they? Maybe, are they the murderers? If it is a murder, I don't think I'm gonna catch them in this thing. There they are. I got ya. Coming. Where are you going? Come on, speed up. There you are. Yeah! Oh. Enter. Hey, we were here earlier. Oh, it's a tape. Hang on. And is there a dead guy inside? There's nobody in there. Yeah, I don't want to leave yet. I need to see. There's a padlock. Do I have to come back here then? I can't get in there. Uh, can I go in his boot? No. Fine, let's leave. Did my car just shut off it did but I'm free like free rolling down the hill come on we can do it we can make it keep going keep going come on damn it Jesus Christ, what was that thing? Something behind me. Uh oh. Quick! Move! This guy's an idiot. Okay, the radio station is gonna be here. But do we really want to get out that close to that freak? I guess we have no choice. Wish we didn't have to put our flashlight away to put the tape in. Masaki no horror na hanashi. Hi, hajimari mashita horror na hanashi. Okay, so that one was a bit weird. Uh, there's this guy and he his fa family were in the hospital and he was complaining that there were always new nurses there was something going on but they never had the same nurses anymore they just kept being switched and one time when he was visiting he noticed another new nurse and he was like who's the new nurse and they were like what new nurse they didn't know what he was talking about he thought that was strange um, and then visiting hours were about to end so he went to the bathroom as he was about to say goodbye he saw the new nurse again so he hid and watched to see what she was doing because before people didn't believe that he had seen a new nurse and the new nurse approached the lady next to his family who had been giving candy out to people and took her away so the guy chased them to see what was going on and caught them at the elevator and the nurse was trying to take this lady in the elevator and as she stopped them and asked if the lady was okay the nurse glared at him like a demon and disappeared and it turns out she was trying to take this old lady to the morgue so she must have been some kind of demon. And now we have to play this other one. These are really long. It's kind of annoying. Masaki no horror na hanashi. Um, that one was actually pretty creepy. Oh, I don't want this bar. Um, so there was a girl, and the guy that was reading got really confused because all the way through he was stopping and apologizing because there were capital letters in weird places. So there's obviously some kind of secret message, I guess. But there was a lady who had a brother in the hospital, and she would go and visit all the time. And it was a lot of work for her, and she was really tired. And then one day, as she was going to the hospital, and she had to speak to the doctor, as she had been, she saw a little boy, and he was crying out, and he called her mom. And when he said he wasn't her mum, the boy cried, so he, she tried to find 
his mother, which she did. Then the mother was so grateful, she said, come and rest and I'll make you tea. She made a tea and gave her a slice of cake and she felt um, kind of peace and relaxed. For the first time she had in a while, she, she was super tired. Um, and then she noticed the time, there was only an hour left of visitation to see her brother, so she rushed out of the house, but she felt bad because she hadn't said a proper goodbye to this nice lady. But when she turned around, the house had disappeared. So they're obviously ghosts. And then as she rushed to the hospital, um, she had a phone call from her brother. Something was going on. She got to the hospital and there was a weird ghost child that looked like her brother. They were trying to stop her getting inside and asked her what she had been up to while he was suffering. Trying to make her feel guilty about relaxing, I suppose. Um, and then when she got to her brother, I think he was dead. It wasn't super clear whether he's dead or not because she said her brother was always by her side always but that could be you know like a metaphor because he's a ghost and then she said something was coming and that's where the guy that was reading the story stopped and got confused because part of the word apparently had capitals for a secret message at least that's what we're going to assume now we got to look at this voice recorder Oh, do we do anything with it? Uh... No? We couldn't actually get that, uh... bag up. Of the trash area. I'm guessing there's a tape in there. We need to go back, but this is, look at that creepy person who's here. So we need to be careful. Okay. I've had an idea. Maybe I give him. Yeah, I give him the. I give him that food. That's cool. Oh, and there is a tape. Nice. That was that noise. Oh my god. Hello. はい、この状況の反響がすごくて嬉しいばかりです。ありがとうございます。ということで、今回も読んでいきますよ。はい。今回もおなじみラジオネーム、高尾さんからです。いつもみたいに。Like uh, そう思っている。弟を私にわからない。私にはお父としかいなかった。友人も親戚も誰も私ののカタカナですね。前の手紙でも何個かありましたね。読めないことはないんですけど。I'm trying to like Figure out what the knocking is coming from. I'm not paying attention to the guy reading the story. Okay. わたしの、みんな不幸になればいい。相手の読んだ時の顔を見るのが好きだった。私たちの世界平行地層平行。ああ、世界へ地層か。あ、やっぱり片仮名入ってると読み間違えちゃいますね。まあ、すいません。続けますね。地層を用意して弟はいつも私
く苦しみも苦しみあ,ああ苦しみですね苦しみも悲しみもすべて忘れて私と共にみんな行こう私の周りではよく人が亡くなる私のせいなのだろうかほらあなたにも会いに行きますよ下の方に何か書いてありますね手紙読みましたかあ全部カタカナで書いてありますね手紙読みましたかですかね手紙てでも手紙ってこれのことじゃないですよね。何のことでしょう。手紙、ちょっと、うん、探してみようと思います。あったら、また次回、読もうと思います。Okay, that's weird. So I didn't get, I missed most of it because I was looking at that creepy lady in the window. Hopefully,、um, you had a chance to read it. But is there a letter that he was supposed to read? There's obviously some kind of message there. I think we've been to all the locations on the map. What was up with that creepy lady? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna have to stop there. I'm a little bit stuck. I don't know what to do next. I feel like we've been everywhere on the map. We've still got two tapes to find. There's also two locks we need to unlock, but I haven't found really any keys to unlock them. If you have any clues, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. And if you're enjoying it, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. It really helps. And I really, really appreciate it. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can find out when I upload new videos. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.